Hello everybody, welcome to Carrots Gaming. I'm your host Carrots, today back at it again with some more in part we're playing the amazing mod Awakening of the Rebellion, playing the amazing sub mod Awakening of the Independencies. So in the last episode, I can't remember if we did anything here. I don't think we did. I know we had a botched ground battle over I believe from Nan, where I accidentally forgot to record it, pretty much. But I think that was pretty much it. I think we had a base battle in the last one, but I cannot actually remember because I'm dumb. But in this one, perfect. We don't just got a Nebulon B. We got a Hero Nebulon B, which is preferable. We have more... Oh man, you couldn't have just gone through... It would have just been right here. It would have been faster. This would have been way faster whenever you're pulling here. I guess maybe it may not be, but shush. Huh. Now comes the question of can this fleet take this one over Solust? By the way, this is 2.11.9, so the TIE Fighter patch has already come out, thankfully. So TIE Fighters are no longer as strong. Uh, maybe if the Fighter Force was a little bit better. We are broke right now because I did actually put the money into building the Tier 3 over this. That way we can have that mission done. We get a couple of Wildwing Bombers out of the deal. And I was already planning on putting a level 3 because this is bordered with Kuat. If we can hold this world, that would be brilliant. Having this little sector here ready to punch it out with Kuat and stuff is perfect. Hmm. Japan. Maybe next time we'll put on a cheap space station for you. Mm. Or we could try and hold it on the ground, I suppose. Uh, it's hard to figure out what I want to do. Uh, oh, I do actually have another one of these off the line, so get up here and join up with this fleet really quickly. Thank you. Shift over to here. We actually did take this, so we should start gearing up for the ground battle. Oh. I kind of forgot that that was here. Um... Infantry is a little weak. I'm hoping we have enough vehicles, because we have one there, a tank destroyer there, anti-tank here, and it is just a tier one, and it's just going to be one outpost, so I don't know how bad it's actually going to be. They are... we got to do something about that. <laughs> We're about to get some money, and I think we should put it into stopping the corruption here and here. Because if they get it here, that means they can come in here and take this. I don't want that. So we're going to get money, please, and thank you. First of all, off the way, I'm going to grab, I believe, which one removes non-combat during ground charge? Uh, running out, destroying into entrance, corruption, wherever found. Okay, we're gonna grab three. Now, I'm gonna shift over to you. You're getting this offline. Brilliant. Or to Banna. Pick up one of these yourself. Okay. Perfect. Money well spent. We're sending this over here. I'm gonna spend the rest of this money. Over at Hoth, give me constructing unit. Oof. Unit cancel. See, what do I have here exactly? Tuscans. Hmm. I mean, X wings. We have two X wings. Having three would be better. We'll have plenty of Z ninety five support from here. Even if they are flights, it's still Z ninety five. So. That should be enough. One Z95, one Y-Wing, so we'll have three bombers. Plus this, I think rounding out our strike fighter force is would be better. In so let's invest into that. As I mean, station's the one that can build us, I believe. Yeah, an unlimited amount of Tuscan Tuscan. I'm just gonna call them Tuscan Starfighters. They're a really good interceptor, honestly, in my opinion. Alright. 
So now, let's start moving ground forces over here. Let's grab them over Monolist. Again, that shifting ground forces over this way. Please that and thank location. you. Because if we can control this entire sector, that will be perfect. Because then I can take this fleet here. We can bolster it enough and start knocking out these tier 1 space station worlds. And these ones if I can. And then we can join them up with this fleet, which would be ideal. Because this one can properly support. Well, this one, I really want you to poke the wheel. Because this is making... I mean, we're making 384 credits off this, but it's making a bunch of money because of its high value. Changing uh, to high gambling activity. So it can be low, but it can also be really high at times. I think maybe we give it a poke. We do have a strong fighter force with this. Or not a strong one, but we have fighters with it. Plus we have this, which is good. T-wings, Y-wings, and R-41s. Plus the A-wings that come from here. The Y-wings that come from here. Plus the Z-95s. I'd maybe wait for that to get there so we can have extra... Extra screening capabilities. It's this one that was my main, like, can we defeat this kind of deal. Because mm. they're going to have fighters from this, because this is going to give them garrison of two TIE fighters. This is going to give them two TIE fighters plus a gunship squadron, plus the main one's going to give them also squadrons, plus whatever ships come in here are going to be giving them TIEs. Pretty much every ship the Empire has gives them a TIE Fighter Squadron. And while granted, TIE Fighters aren't great, they're not pushovers. <laughs> they can take out a lot of my stuff if I'm not careful. Also, now that this fleet is here, let's pop you over to Point Man. We need to bolster this fighter force, because this one's good. It's got two Z-95s, one arc, but it's not fantastic. Plus, having more screening capabilities would be ideal. Unfortunately, I just don't have the money to make any of that happen. So, we're gonna have to wait. We are getting... The over you work. That will give us an extra 500, which will boost up to over the 8,000 plus this. So, we should be nearing 9,000 credits a week. Which is really good, because that would mean, like, we're starting to make enough bank, like, almost every week we might be able to start pumping up capital ship. Just to, like, put it into perspective, not that I would want to do that, because that seems poor. So, mercenary recruitment, don't like that. Black Sun Prisons, don't like that. Okay. Uh, you have this on the ground. We're also going to grab one of you, or maybe not. Let's not do that, actually, because <laughs> I'm not intending on keeping this world. Like, if they attack, I might just sell this. Or auto-resolve it, actually. Just to weaken them up a bit. Polis, you have... Pretty much nothing on the ground. Let's fix that. Um... I hmm. guess we don't really have a lot of forces to fix that, because I do want to keep... Interesting. This actually... We have a fairly strong ground-fighting force here. Because of all of these, plus this tier 1s, but these ones are the main ones because these can drop shield gems, which are awesome. Also, Japan, you can get us this. Ooh, get infection, 200 credits. I might have to take you up on that offer. Alright, gonna get paid soon, which is good. What am I waiting for exactly? Oh yeah, I know what I'm waiting for, and I just think I just heard one come off the line. Correct. You oink this. Stop them from doing terrible things to us. And let's see if we can give them a poke. Mission log updated. Mission log updated. Failed. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm working on this. I'm gonna fail this one. Support isn't looking too good for us right now. We have 32. We're gonna be losing some because I can't do the refugee escort one because I just don't have the stealth units. That will reduce us by 6. I can do this, but this is only going to increase us by, I believe, two. 
What are you? Okay, you're X-Wing. Cool. I can't wait to tell we're making proper bank from this and this, plus the manufacturing base will also be- Ooh, our ship's almost here. Good, good, good. We can begin our raid on Naboo. What does Naboo give us? What can we build on Naboo? Um, Alliance Base, Medium Factory, but N1 Starfighters and Speeders on this planet. That's good. That's always good. Minor Land Factory. Okay. That's cool. During change from Black Sun to Empire. So Empire and Black Sun are fighting. I assume. Yeah, over here. That's good. I now know where the Empire is focusing their efforts are. They're focusing their efforts on this front line. I will take that. Plus, damn. They've been expanding, haven't they? <laughs> Though they just cut them off, so somewhere on this side there's one without a fleet. But Ormondel and this plan are hard enough to take alone. Hmm. I really want to poke this fleet, but I just don't know if it has the capabilities of taking out the wheel, but I want to do it before they put too much on it. I almost had a stupid idea, like, what if I put this here and then had this fleet and then relied on this fleet to punch through these defenses to connect them, but that just seems dumb. That seems very, very, very dumb. Alright, we're gonna get that. We're gonna get paid, and I'm probably gonna put most of this into additional fighters for our fi our, our forces that are kind of lacking in fighter production. And we get... Come on, come on. Oh, 900. Perfect. We just get an extra couple of bucks. 901. Thank you. Perfect. 8,000. Let's put some of this into two squads of X-Wings. Perfection. Going to shift over to here. Camino. Grab us. Unit in production. A couple of squads Unit of these. Perfection. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then we're going to actually save the rest of the money. Shockingly enough. Ooh, but we could get one of these, but no. I don't want to keep going broke every single time I by the end of the week before anything happens. I need to actually start stockpiling some credits. Let us get into a fight. We're gonna wait till this, till the three squads are here. Mission log? Hello? Yeah, 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 I know. Okay, so now what's our support? 20. Not great, but we'll be up to 22 here because I am actually already in the process of doing this, plus the forces from that will be very, very, very beneficial. Manan, are you almost done with that? Or Anta Antar, or whatever you are. <laughs> Beginning construction. Please build that. Please don't leave any world without any of that, especially that close to the front line. Are we there yet? Are you gonna come here and do terrible things to them yet? Come on. <laughs> Alright. First battle of the day. Let's get it going. Drop down with just the weaklings. Wait. Wait a minute. Why aren't you showing him that? Oh no, you are. I'm just dumb. Ignore me. Kyle Katarn's still not with us. You are not actually a stealth unit, are you? Are you a stealth unit? No, you're not. Okay, set times. Okay, let's see if we can damage this enough. Anti-air will be our main thing. Alright, let's get this thing going. Alright. Pause. Perfect. Grab you, and I want you to immediately run over that way. Like, before we do anything else. Start moving. Start running. Actually get up to here. Anti-air is going to be so important. I actually don't remember this even being here. That's a... This planet seemed... This map seems a tad bit different, actually, because this wasn't here before. Grabbing that and getting anti-air is going to be super, super, super important. I'm going to wait till we have more than just a couple of scouts from here. Same with you. We're going to wait till we have everything, so start staging up there. Let us grab... You... Let's just grab them all. No reason not to. 
Okay, six. Perfect. And we're gonna actually march with the Gungans from here because you give us... Yeah, two Gungans, two Gaunted Troopers at a time. They already began to attack. Yeah, just let them bug you. I want you two to start staging. You just start going that way. We're gonna wait till you, because you get one Gagan plus two fast speeders. That'll be an entire squad. That'll be very, 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 very important. You start moving up this way as well. Gungans, you're gonna be important for our team here. Get anti-aircraft. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Can I just get Gungans? No. That'd be, that'd be a stupid screenshot. Grip one. One. Just move out to here. Captain Solo, perfect. Oh no! That's really bad. Huh. Please kill this. Desperately. Drop this. Everybody hide under it. Okay, please. Actually, hitting us would be fantastic. Okay, pause, pause, pause. What, did you just launch this? No, okay. Move up. Okay. Continue to just move up. Also you, also move up. Ooh, backline. Please, do terrible things to them. Like, actually run this way, run this way, run this way. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't do that. Come back here. Or actually, no, run up. You're actually having the right idea. Get up there. Get another one of these, because if they can stop this, maybe we can get the other one. Maybe they'll just change fire and we can at least get one of them up. Come on, 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 come on. Make them change fire, make them change fire. Don't... Stop shooting at that. Build another one. Okay, thank god. They're dead. All of them are dead. Good one, move out. I legitimately no longer care about that. These, these guys will just tear them to pieces. If you'll hit them... Okay, that's it. Group one. And... Group two. Move out and stop them from doing any shenanigans. And move out. Thank you very much. They have not actually moved their forces up here yet. And if they have, I'm just gonna cause problems for them. They probably have, and we're probably actually gonna get some fire from that in like two seconds. They have not. Hold this. Hold it. Get up here. Now. Pause. Group one. Gungan man. Get up here. Grab it. It's imperative that this happens. Get up here and grab it. Where are they? Where did- why did they not- I mean, I know they're shooting at that, that's great. But where are they? Where are the troops? They're here. They ran away. That's brilliant. Go die. We can legitimately just tear through you. Firing position. Oh, move up. Don't be ridiculous. How are you not dead yet? That's a great question. Hey. Why don't you start doing terrible things to them? Group 1. Get down. Because this is going to be one hell of a fight if we're not ready for it. Gungans, you are a cannon folder if I remember. No, you're discharged. Cool. Just continue to move out. And get up to here immediately. And I actually want you two to hold position here. While you actually run up, please. And don't just stand there and let them shoot you. Never mind. Um, We're a little too far away for you to do anything, aren't we? Can you actually target that? You are technically in range of it. But we're only getting like one hit at a time. 
Where are you? Please move up. You're gonna be imperative to this endeavor. Pause. You have no way of dunking down. That's a shame. That's destroyed. <laughs> Grab us one of these, please, and thank you. Alright, all units now. Because I got what I needed. And you, you grab anti-infantry. Engage. With them. And, do. This is still building. Brilliant. Move out and attack this. Get up from position. Just run, just run. Everybody rush. Get up to here as fast as possible and just start lobbing things at them. Hit this, because it's a barracks, so they're going to have means of attacking us. Get up here, it's imperative that you get up here and you protect this unit. Or this one, actually. Just get up here and start... ...shielding the ones that they're focused on. Perfect. All units now. Pause. Yes, people will die if you do not hurry up. Because we're getting eaten up by this, so we gotta be careful with that. Crouch down, I think we're all in range at this point. No, we're not. We are not in range. Just get up. Our hero units are here, though. Yes, we are. Give us all of your special abilities to destroy and murderize these guys. Marine gauge this, because these guys have the highest potential to kill you. Okay, murderize this building now. And kadoosh, kadoosh. Okay, we're doing good, we're doing good. And we got more speeders inbound, that's brilliant. That'd be very, very, very helpful. Okay, they have ties. We gotta be really careful with this. Because the second this comes online, though, this whole map's covered, and it's almost online. So we're almost golden here. And... Come on, give us a couple of rockets or somebody. And this is done. And just immediately locks on and starts deciding to tear these guys a new one. Brilliant! They help if you hit them. As it turns out, the giant cannons work best when hit. Focus on this one. Because you can. Because it's the weakest one. What's this? Nothing. Okay. Move out this way where I know the ties are. That's one tie dead. Focus on the next lowest health one. Douche, perfect. Next round out. Is a miss, but keep going, keep going, keep going. Get up to here, and we'll grab. Just start destroying this. And we'll get anti-vehicle here. Just start helping us take out this, just cause. Ooh, that's a good shot if I can get that perfect. Okay, perfect. Also, is it always nighttime here or does that change? Come on, give us all your special abilities. Come on. How are you not getting just demolished by the cannon? Are you not in range or something stupid like that? You aren't. Ooh, the tracking's good, the tracking's good, the tracking's good. Kadoosh, perfect. That's another tie out of the sky, perfection. Your grenades are pretty damn useless for this. Where are you? You're just more of this. 
perfect. Actually, grab that. We'll make that anti-infantry. We have secured a build pad. That's good. Kill this, please. It's like your only job. Grab anti-infantry. The tracking is not good on that one. Grab one of these just so they can't, aren't just destroying us. Don't, don't give us a real you best fire. Can you do anything? Fire position. That gives you increase your fire rate, doesn't it? Uh, reduce damage taken, but also reduces movement speed. Don't really care about that. You are shooting at this, right? You're not, because it is not a build. No, you are. Perfect. Just not as often as I would like you to. Alright, come on. Is it that hard? They're just round after round coming out. How are you missing? Oh, the tracking's good. It missed. Thanks. Excuse me. Can you focus on this, actually? You can't. That's sad. Can the anti-infantry one? No, because it's about to get eaten. Uh, give us heavy shots from the cannons. Perfection. Can you actually all just focus down on this last tie, please? Like, everybody just shoot at it? Okay, better strategy. Rush down. Rush down. Rush. Move this closer to the anti-infantry- the anti-air flak cannon. This- they made it way more easy to survive even with those flat cannons, and the tracking is not good. I thought I had it. Where were you shooting at, buddy? We're just gonna fight underneath this and see how you like that. Are you actually shooting at it? Can you shoot at this too? You can! The turrets can actually shoot at them. They're not great at hitting them, but they can do it. Come on. Come on. <laughs> this is getting a little ridiculous now. Let's see the shot, let's see the shot. It's not gonna hit, but you definitely are looking at him real good. I guess not. I thought I saw him take a shot, but I guess I might have been mistaken. Oh, brilliant. Also, there's another one right here. That'd be interesting to take. We could have this whole line of defense as we wait to try and hammer down onto these guys here as they come up. Alright. That was good. We did not lose anybody, and Naboo is now ours. Brilliant. Funny enough, the Gungans were actually pretty detrimental to that. Did we just lose volume again? God damn it. Oh. I mean, no we didn't. We're just in a battle. Okay, well, I kind of expected that to happen. They can train death in here? Okay, no you can't. I was about to say, just auto-resolve that. Yeah, I don't really care about that. That entire one was just to test our unit. Like, I didn't ever plan on actually keeping this world. That was just to test our unit. And it tested fine, so now we focus down on Naboo. Hey, Naboo, we don't have any money for you, so you're gonna have to hold out with just what you got, which isn't great. I could send a Dronaut over there, but it seems like a poor life decision. Um, I mean, I could just no, that'd be dumb. I'm glad I can't. We'll just have to hold with them. And maybe they'll retreat, question mark? Or they'll try and hit it, which would be dumb. Uh, but we now own Naboo, so I think something comes from that. I might be mistaken, but I'm fairly certain something comes from owning Naboo. 
still no sound. I'm gonna attempt to fix this, and I'm gonna not mess it up. Please do not mess up my sound. I'm not even gonna stop recording. I'm just gonna try and mess with my sound system now, because I don't want to mess. And there we go. There we go. Sound is back and operation. And we have one more coming off the line here. Perfect, perfect. Here to serve. Pause. Here, serve. What just happened? Oh, we got all of our infiltrators. Or not infiltrators. What are you? Oh. Yeah. Come on. Lag. Oh my god. Take out the one over this first. Thank you. And then... Take over the one on this one. Please and thank you. Of course indeed proof. Especially this one, because they're sabotaging us. Which means we're debuffed if they attempt to attack us, which is not great. I really wish there was something I could do about this, but there isn't at the time, unfortunately. Also, everything's cheaper on Utopia. Is there a reason for that? Is there a particular reason? Sabotage? For, uh, no, no. There's no real reason for this. But everything's cheaper here, which is kind of awesome. Naboo, you make us $70 an hour, and you can mail us uh, specialty units. Come on. Come on. Give us the money. Give us the money. Let's speed this up a little bit, how scary that is. And... C come on. Come on. Come on. Any day now. You can do it. There we go. Beginning Get us ground immediately. I could focus on some tech, maybe. How much does it take to get tech in the air? I'm just curious. It takes about 10,000. <laughs> Oof. To get base tech. We're about to have this off the line, so we might, depending on how long I've been recording for, try and attack this one. Maybe in the next episode I'll do that one. Let us... Get everything together here. Log. We'll try and attack this one. Mission lock. Remove corruption from capable heroes. Oh! Well, well, well. Thank you very much. I'm already working on that. Uh, you're almost done there. You're not even close to here. Anyway, I think I'm gonna leave that one here. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe. If you want to see any more of my shenanigans and Empire War, go check out my other playlists. If you want to play this mod or the sub mod, all links will be in the description below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!